Hey everybody, welcome back to Conquer's Bad Fur Day. So, I looked up what to do, and the problem was I'm trying to hit the wrong person with the frying pan. So, we're just... Oh god, we're back to jumping again. Okay. See, I got this down now. Anyways, so what I'm supposed to do here, apparently, is just to smack the gargoyle with the frying pan. A frying pan? <laughs> you stupid little... Now someone else gets to know how it feels to fall into a hole. You pass one thing, another thing falls in your way. Uh, not over there. Alright. Yes. Plunger with dynamite. Um, I think I know what's gonna happen now. Uh, yeah, you're gonna move around. Oh, oh. Yep. Fantastic. Let's go and get some shut eye. Finally. I don't know. I think you you seem to be functioning pretty well now, Conker. I think you should just keep it on. So, he goes and gets someone who can make a flying chair to fix his table. That is called overpaying, right there. You, ma you can make a flying chair, you can't make What do you mean you can see? You just fix the table. what happened last time. <laughs> on it all well, on it well. I I'll go now. I don't want to have to get the dog tape out again. <laughs> uh, yes. Wait, no. Andre, duct I don't tape fixes everything. Get the duct tape out again. You know what, why don't you just uh, take the duct tape bye. and bye. fix the table with that? Just tape it like up to the ceiling or something. I don't know. I don't care. Tape it to one of those pillars. Duct Make tape. it a shelf. I'll get him a duct tape. <laughs> asshole. I'll come down here. I'll show him what the duct tape is. I'll show him where to stuff it. Stupid. All I do all day is try to sort his stupid problems out of the asshole I need it. Anyway, so what are we? Um, the milk, the milk, the table, the table, the table. What are we doing? What are we doing with this? Um, Just clean make a slate. Yeah, leg. clean slate. Uh, this, uh, I have to grab the chocolate. So it's kind of working. Uh, that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. I don't know about that. I don't think chocolate is part of a squirrel's balance diet. Apparently it is now, though. Right, how do I... There we go. Aha. Come on, get up there. There you go. Yeah. The camera controls on this game are just... Like, like most N64 games, they leave something to be desired. It really hurts the playability. Okay. Ooh, those nasty, messy wasps! I thought that was what a guy. Whatever shall we do? My beautiful hive is gone! Oh, I'll never be 
never see it again now. Well, what do you want me to do about it? Please get it back for us. Otherwise, I don't know what we're going to do. <laughs> okay, okay, calm down. I'll go and get it for you. Now, where is it? Oh, just follow the signs. <laughs> oh, whatever I'm saying. It's convenient that there's signs leading up to her. Lost Hive. What's down? Do not. If I've learned anything, it's to not go into any sort of water with the current. All right, who's this? I think I want to damn scales. I think we should get down there and kick the shit out of him. All right, we'll wait till he comes up there. All right. Okay, then. Yeah. Hello, it's me again. Mr. Scarecrow Birdie. Right. What seems to be the problem? Oh, yes. You need manual. Although I don't know. That doesn't work. Manual. I cost you. Oh, how much? Uh, got any Mepsi box? What? Don't matter. Actually, uh, I think, uh, well, uh, uh, a ten dollar. Long time. <laughs> that manual, long time. That. Again, for all you non cinema connoisseurs, that would be a reference from Stanley Kruger's Full Metal Jacket. Why? How do I. Can I use the chocolates? I don't know. Oh my god. Is chocolate my health, I guess? Let's go over here and get this one then. There, problem solved. I don't think I want to do that quite yet. Let's go up this hill. No, I tried to fly past. I personally highly doubt this worm can dig through rock like that. Oh god, please don't toss me off. Alright. Oh, who are those guys? Oh, hello there. Um, and what do you do then? Hmm. It'll cost you. Oh, how much? A lot. Come back when you got more money. Go on. On your bike. Okay, where do I go? Oh my god, I'm trying to go down the mountain. You stupid worm. And now I'm almost dead. Fan freaking tastic. Okay, so I went up there. And that was useless. Let's try over here. Oh, I see some barbed wire. Did I just kill? I'm probably dead, aren't I? Yep. That's wonderful. Oh, I was supposed to die. That's good. Yes, you boy. Yes, Morgan Freeman. You are dead. Dead as a 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 dead. Grim Reaper. Don't laugh. Aren't you a little shot to be a Grim Reaper? Well, how many Grim Reapers have you met before, mate? What, what am I supposed he's to He's got elf shoes yeah, and he sounds like an point. elf. Well made. I'm convinced now, he's an elf. Let's see. Ah, oh, yes. Conquer. Surname? The Squirrel. The Squirrel. The... 
Oh, bloody hell, you would have to be a sodding squirrel, wouldn't you? Why, is there a problem with that? Well, yes, there is, actually. It's like those bloody cats. Such a pain in the ass. You're one of these special cases. Oh, really? Yes. Apparently, according to the powers that be, I just do my job. I do what I'm told. I don't even get paid very much. Apparently, squirrels can have as many lives as they think they can get away with. Oh, I see. So I'm not dead. No, dead. But not quite. <laughs> right. Well, uh, I'll be off then. Just you wait, smart ass. You don't get out of it that easily. Now, the thing is, you may not be dead. But that doesn't mean you can't die. You just have a few more, shall we say, chances. Yeah. Like cats. I hate those things. Right. <laughs> Distribute around your little I'm sure Conker hates cats too, tail things. Greg. I'm sure he Squirrel's does. tails. If you can get them, I'll give you an extra chance. Understand? Um, well, sounds a bit strange, but okay. Strange? The best. Bloody deal, you're going to get you, little prick. Come on. Piss off. There we go. I've got some cats to see. Bloody things. I hate those bloody cats. The way they meow and they piss everywhere. And their shit smells just bloody old. Come on. You got this. Almost there. Come on. Just disappear into the darkness. There we go. Okay. <gasps> ah. Um. Oh, yep. Those are your shoes. And that's this guy. And that reminds me of the stupid Zelda hands. But um, anyways. Glad I don't have to see that cutscene ever again, because... Man, was that laggy. Well, oh, maybe not quite. I spoke too soon. I spoke way too soon. Come on. Come on. Alright, well, I guess I'm ending the episode here because the game doesn't seem to want to cooperate. Uh, thank you for watching. Again, it's another cutscene kind of kind of episode, so I apologize for the fact that I haven't actually done much playing besides getting killed. But, um, yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you come back next time. Peace out. Boop.